Just like many of you, I grew up here at Omaha's Henry Dorley Zoo and Aquarium. Now, I'm returning once a week to learn more about the animals who call our zoo home and to better introduce you to our furry, feathery, scaly, slimy, and very unique neighbors. It's an animal you can only find slithering around in two AZA accredited zoos in the country. It's the Inland Taipan. They like to call them the deadliest snake in the world. However, that's not true. They are the most venomous snake in the world, but if you call them the most deadly snake, you're technically not correct. There's actually no reported human fatalities from Inland Taipans. In fact, they're actually known to be somewhat tame around humans, even wild Inland Taipans. They don't tend to like strike out at you or anything. Lead keeper of dome reptiles, Matt Tejan, says the tests to determine how venomous a snake is are done on mice. Just the amount of toxin needed to kill 50 mice. And rodents are what these snakes typically eat in their natural habitat in Australia. That's a really dry, desolate area, and they actually live, everything in there, in that habitat lives underground, because there is no cover up above ground. So they, they live in like these deep fissures that are made in the dry soil which could be part of the reason the Inland Taipan tops the list. So they actually developed this super toxic venom against rodents, so they don't, they basically kill it instantly. The Inland Taipan always has a darker colored head, but it is the only known snake species that changes the color of its body throughout the seasons. So in the winter months, they're going to be like a dark brown or almost black to absorb more sun and heat their bodies up faster. Whereas in the summertime, they start to turn into more of a golden yellow. And that's to reflect the sun, to do the opposite of what they want to do in the winter. To reflect the sun because it gets so hot there, they don't want to go out of their burrow and then just be cooked instantly. Four of these snakes call Omaha home. Two of them still very new. We became the first AZA institution to reproduce the Inland Titan. Even if you're not a snake person, Come on, these little ones are pretty cute. And for some, even the big ones are lovable. So this is why I don't understand why people are so scared of snakes. I'm just, just a curious little animal is all they are. You can check out these snakes for yourself inside the Desert Dome.